I think it's very hard to narrow down to one thing, right? But the way I've always felt about professional wrestling, especially modern professional wrestling, and it's something TNA has consistently being being a uh, <clears throat> has been constantly doing a great job with, is that what you see the actual match, right? The actual twenty minutes or so that Ali and I spent in the ring really is the just the tip of the iceberg. Mm -hmm. And that's what the audience really gets to see. And then beyond that, you know what I mean? There was the the month-long feud, the build-up, the matches, the storylines that led up to the match. But even like further behind that is two very complete human beings that put so much effort and hard work and like this is their careers culminating. And I mean, the story behind the match runs so much deeper than two... You know, to not to go back to the cliche, but two men without pants fighting for a golden belt. Uh, it's it's really two like human beings with their own paths that have taken them there. And I mean, Ali has his his own story with like representing a culture and having a, a people and and trying to go and use this platform to promote their struggles is a big part of it. And I, in a, in a completely different way of kind of doing, I'm kind of doing the same thing. Right. And this is mm -hmm. very much a story about being Quebecois. And then you had er Earl Hebner in there and his own story of redemption. And this is like, this is, this is just a wrestling match. It's a 10 minute wrestling match, but this allows you to see like lives being actually changed by this fight.